Hey guys, how's it going? It's Thang and welcome to this video. So today we are going to be doing a succulent arrangement and you guys have been asking me for to do one for quite a while. Now I just didn't really have the succulents to do them but I do have some leftovers from my sales that pretty much nobody buys because they're, they're like the, the uh, orphanage red-headed child. You know, kind of sad but they're my babies now anyways. You know, redheads turn out to be really fucking hot when they're older. Oh my god, I love hair heads a lot. Anyways, uh, so I want to do that, but also, you know, a message to you guys, it doesn't really matter whether you are good at doing arrangements or not, it's about the thought that counts, and this special message has been brought to you by Jemai King. I love you. I love you, Jemai. Love, Alec. You know, like, she's a crap drawer up, but, you know, it's not really the point. So let's get started. All right, you guys, so we have everything set up right here, all our stuff that we need. Uh, we do have our little pot right here. You can see it already has a hole in the center. You can go, oh, look, look, see? You can, you can poke your finger, perfectly fits in right there. So you do have to find a little pot that does have uh, a hole inside, you know, because that's really great for drainage. If you don't, drill one into it. If you can't, well, find another one, okay? Um, anyway, so this is great for drainage right there. See? Ooh, it's inside. Ooh, it fits perfectly fine with my finger, too. Um, yeah, anyways. Uh, so we have that. We have our succulent orphanage, you know, red-headed stepchild. Well, green-headed stepchild in this one, because uh, they don't get picked because they're green, you know. Nobody likes green. Um, actually, I, I love these ones because these ones are actually very lovely. I got my succulent mixture right here. Here, I got some clay balls and stuff like there. I got some pebbles which you can find outside, you know, clean them off, you know, sanitize them, whatever. And then I got my seashell by the seashore. Guys, do not buy cheap ass seashells at the dollar store because they break up. Go to Michael's, buy some of the nice ones, you know, so they don't break up, okay? And we got some of our top dressing right here. So, let's get started the first thing we need always need to do is put a fiberglass mesh right here this is pretty much windowsill mesh uh, onto our little hole right here because we don't want things to fall down this actually catches the small particles the next thing we do is we grab some of our clay balls you know hydroponics type of um you know thingies we put them there um hyperponic rocks we put them there so this way it gives us a false bottom you know so that way the water just doesn't sit there it just drains down um a little bit more on the side you know you don't really have to do this as well i like doing this i always like doing this for my second so that way the water just doesn't sit and then slowly seep it just gets to there and just steeps down next we have to do is we have to put in our soil mixture remember um use cactus soil mixture um this is what i usually do. they do not sponsor me i wish they did though but miracle go cactus soil is actually perfect even without you know putting some extra new i mean more bigger particles in because they still drain like that but i like them to drain even more so that way i have a lesser percent chance of like uh root rotting so this is what i do i'm using a spoon because my mom has put charcoal in this great but dirties my hand really quick so I don't want my hands to be that dirty yet I mean if we are gonna be a classy hoe we're gonna be a classy hoe okay don't be a dirty hoe be a classy hoe always be a classy hoe okay there you go there you go and honestly I'm not really good at doing designs I mean I, I am designer thing here but I'm not really good at it. Just be full of yourself. Honestly, be full of yourself and be proud of what you do, no matter what people say, because you know what? Their opinion sucks balls anyway. What matters most is you being happy. Um, let's see. Ta -cha 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 -cha. Okay. And always have, always put it up even more. Okay. Now, we're going to use some of them because some of them have, you know, longer stem right here. And this one has a lot of roots already coming out. You know, so we're gonna put them up here. And let's, let's, you know what? Let's pre-design them. Let's pre-design. I know I want to put this here. Pre-design them, and and you know, put them in places where you think you want to put them. I think that looks beautiful, beautiful kind of like. And we can cram them all in. I think I like this one here. I like this sang a, which I don't understand why people did not buy that one. That one's actually beautiful. You know, just just lay them in, lay them in if you want to, and yeah. I think this is good because we can't really do anything about this one uh, why not well because it's a three head three head you know everybody loves to get their heads on right do, do, do. Do, do, do. 
champagne is gonna be huge so we don't want that in there we are gonna put this probably somewhere else this one is here okay and that's it so we also also don't want to cram I mean we can cram everything in if you want to because they're just tightly knit together but also we want to show up some of our some of our like things right here so I might take something out um, I think I'm gonna take this out I'm, no you know what this is gonna be in the center hold on I want this in the center oh that's beautiful okay this on the side and I think that's it that's that's you know what I think that is what we're gonna do okay so we're gonna use one two three four five five of these right here sorry sorry stepchild you have to be in another video I'm so sorry I am so so sorry red-headed stepchildren I honestly I love redheads they're like the ugly duckling of the world they literally are the ugly duckling of the world. When they get, when they grow up, they become super hot, super, super, super hot. This is also why I don't like playing with dirt, especially with charcoal inside. You know. Okay, so we got that. Uh, we wanted to put this here, right? So we're gonna dig a little, dig a little here, and just put that in there. Like Laura Eubank says, you know. Um, as long as your succulent stands, you've done your job. You literally have done your job. This is like, this is very beautiful. This is a pansy. Uh, people bought the smaller pansy, not the big one like this one. So we're gonna dig that in. That's it, see? You you guys are a professional already. More professional than I am, eh? So this doesn't have a long stem, but it's already growing out roots. See that root? See that root? Yeah, you see the root? Yeah, okay. Anyways, it's blurred, but you see the root. So we don't have to do anything digging. We just have to like snuggle it right there. Okay, this one we're gonna. Ooh, that's that's a lot of rooting already. It's a lot of rooting. So we're gonna have to like cram this one in here. Okay, that's fine. Cram that one in there, and this one we're gonna cram this one over here. Okay. Remember, like I said, even if you're a shit artist, that's not the point. The point is trying. The point is actually just doing and trying. And just making everything happy. Be yourself. Just be yourself. I think that's good. That uh, that is beautiful as it is already. So we're gonna mount this up, okay? And we're gonna use a smaller spoon. You know, we gotta use some detailing, detailing, uh, ooh, ooh, detailing um, tools. That's what we call them, detail tools, right? Add that detail in. There you go. Okay. And that is our nice succulent arrangement. I mean, honestly, you should use some filler, spiller, whatever, but I mean, I don't want to waste these, you know? I don't want to waste these. So now we're going to top dress it. Use our detail spoon. Top dress it. Right? Make it look like a desert. We've got some, some stuff there. Okay. Okay, girl. Okay. Okay. Make, make it look like a desert. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, that is beautiful. Oh, I hope this is recording, Ashley. <laughs> oh, it is recording. Okay, that's done. Now we're gonna put some of our fine detailing into our our little succulent arrangements right here. Okay, that needs it there. That. Oh no, no, that's too symmetrical. So we're gonna put it that here. Okay, and then we're gonna put some rocks here. You see? I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just like putting shit everywhere. As long as it looks nice to your eyes, I think that's the most important thing. I'll be right back, hold on. Sorry, I forgot this one important tool. These are, you know, whatever they're called. You have to use them to take the small particles off of your succulents. Because, I mean, once they're on there, they look kind of shitty, right? Put them off. Oh, get off. Get off. Get off. Okay, use this side. Brush that off. You know, you gotta find detail it. Like, have you guys ever pro watched Project Runway? It's about the editing work, you know? You can shove everything into it and call it a day, but at the end of the day, you gotta learn how to edit this shit, right? If you don't learn how to edit this shit, it just looks like a hot mess. And hot messes are still hot, but they're just too hot. Okay, let's put this here. No, no. Okay, let's put this here. Okay, that looks good. No, that looks shit. That looks like shit. 
That looks like shit. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put this here though. That looks good. Okay, that looks beautiful. Oh, you know what? Let's put that. Oh, that looks beautiful. Okay, okay that looks beautiful. And we're gonna put this here. All right, give it, give it some nice, nice texture. Okay, I'm gonna put that there. Okay, that, there you go. That looks nice. Okay, and just a little fine detail right there. Uh, do we have any small? Oh, we have some small ones right here. Uh, we're gonna put this one over here. You know, coral, right? Some of this here as well. And then pebbles here and here. I mean, we, we want some of our top dressing pebbles to show too. So, I think that's it. A little fine detail of removing these pebbles in here. There you go. There you go. Hold on. I got some more left to work to do, you know? Designer's work is never done. Oh, man. And then you call it a day, you, you know, you buy your iced coffee or whatever you want to. And let's put this here as well. Small little detail does count. Brownie points for the small details, you know? Brownie points, right? Brownie points. And Viola. Hold on, I got, I think I got one more here. Let's put another one here. Put another one right here. Okay. There you go. Viola, my beautiful, um, you know, succulent arrangements that I've done in like 10 minutes or less. You know, it's about being happy. I think I like it. I'm gonna fertilize this shit and it's gonna grow and it's gonna destroy things. Anyways, thank you you guys so much for watching this video. Um, like I said, succulent arrangement, it's really about you just designing whatever you feel like it and making yourself happy. And that's it. Oh, that got stuck in my hand. Here you go. Does that look beautiful? I think that looks beautiful. Let's let's do it from the side. Hold on. One moment. There you go. See? Beautiful artwork by Thang. Not so bad. Not so shabby. Look. Ooh. Ooh. Who wants to buy one of these? Ooh. Ooh. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Love you. Bye.